All right, what is up, everyone? What is up, everyone? I think we're we're gonna be starting our stream here. Uh, if I can get it to work, though. Come on. Let's see. Why does it always do this? This is like no signal or some shit. Let's see. I mean, it's obviously working here.
Now if I can get this goddamn capture card to work. Come on, capture card. What's wrong with you now? It's like it's misbehaving. Deactivate, activate it. See if that does anything. No signal. Okay, what the hell? Why is my HDS not working all of a sudden? Come on, baby. Try to figure this out, guys. I'm, I'm sorry about this. Huh? You want to throw it away? Go ahead, throw it away. Okay. Of course, it decides not to work all of a sudden. Come on, let me replug it in. Ugh, son of a bitch is being like stubborn today. <laughs> what the hell? Why is it not working today? What? Give me a second here. It's obviously working there. It's working on my, um, on the Elgato software. That's for some reason it's not exactly working on here. There we go. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. Little technical difficulty there. I had to like just basically set the whole damn thing. Not sure what exactly happened there. All right, back with Sugan and Five, guys. Back with Sugan and Five. All right. So last we left, we uh we finished visiting Lord Lake. And where else did we visit? Uh, Lord Lake and um, um, Raffley. And then we came back to Rainwall. And then, of course, everybody's speculating that um, Salem is uh, basically going to be using us and be trying to betray us. So, right now we're trying to figure out what to do. But I think, oh yeah, that's right, we're trying to get our tactic uh, tactician, Lady Mer uh, Mercies. Mercies? Mercies? Throw away. Good job. High five. 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 High
weapon. Why is there a magnet here? No touch. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. Um. Alright, so we were supposed to talk to everybody about Lady Mercy's. Oh, what a terrible state of affairs. We don't want a war here. Wars are supposed to happen in other places. Hey, no yelling, guys. I like to stop touching that. We were supposed to talk to everybody about Lady Mercy's. And I can't seem to, uh... Um... I can't seem to find him. Or seem to figure out who I needed to talk to exactly. But what's wrong with it? It's better than sending thousands of soldiers off to die senselessly in some foolish war. Don't you agree, your highness? Everybody's like just asking me for their opinion. Like, what the fuck do you want from me, man? It's a queendom, not a kingdom. There's people here I need to talk to. Silent and uh, George is pretty much missing. It's me and uh, Leon. Leon. Leon is still kind of annoying. Just she's the uh, she's the overly attached uh, character in this game. Everyone in Sable, including Lord Ru Rubel, Paul, Robel. Robert is deeply offended by Godwin's action. Rest assured that the people here will understand which side is just. Who else can I talk to? There's like nobody else I can talk to here. Unless there's like people outside of town I can talk to. What do you have? What are you doing? Are you wiping on your shirt? Go wash your hand. Make sure you guys don't drop the cookies. If you drop cookie, pick it up. Give uncle. Give daddy, Madeline. Okay, don't be dropping cookies. If you drop it, pick it up, okay, Coraline? All right. Let's try leaving town, see if it Thing. I'm aware that your duties as well and organize an army that I believe fights for the good of Elena. But my responsibility will always be to care for the inevitable tragedy that results from the fighting. So obviously I'm not so talk to that. Sometimes the really weird boat docks here. They say it belongs to defective. Hmm. I didn't realize this whole section was down here to be honest. Um, excuse me. A client? Hmm. Client? Is that Ty Ho's brother? Ah, uh, who cares? It's just some brat. Hey, Shigir. Shigiri. Please don't call our clients brats. Don't you realize who these people are? This is Prince Feyador, and that's Leon, one of the Queen's Knights. Actually, I'm still just an a... What? He's a prince? Uh, what a pain. Shigeri, try to show some respect. Shigeri, you need to be on your best behavior too. Um, I must apologize for them, your highness. Please do not take offense. Welcome to the Orboro Detective Agency. Swift investigations, privacy guaranteed, nothing but the straight facts. My name's Fuyo, and I take care of all the behind the scenes works, administration, accounting, and so on. These two are Sagiri and Shiguri. Shiguri. They are, they are our investigators. Nice to meet you two. We are incredibly honored that your highness and the Queen's Knight will visit our establishment. Like I said, I'm still just in a... 
Wow, I had no idea that the Prince and the Queen's Knight would even know about a little place like ours. Our reputation must precede us. That's clearly why you sought us out. Our investigations, our investigative skills are second to none. Years ago, I was just another client seek, seeking Detective Oberos' help. The sheer brilliance he used to solve my mystery removed me, so I just had to seek employment here. Oh my, I feel so embarrassed. <laughs> Your Highness, our boss is out of the office at the moment. If you have some business, please come back later. Later sounds good. Well, we do have things we need to do. Oh, really? Well, have a good time. Thank you. We'll try. Hey, girly. Wait a second. Uh, are you talking to me? I'm waiting. I was just thinking. You're kind of cute. Excuse me? Shigure, mind your manners. This is a queen's night. Uh, like I keep telling everyone, I'm still in an up. Well, sorry for bugging you, cutie. Catch you later. Uh, yeah. We'll definitely be excusing ourselves now. Spaghetti, you think? I know. <clears throat> what could His Highness want, want us to investigate anyway? Alright, my lips are sort of chapped. Let's go back in. Lady Mercy is being held in a gay prison. There's no way to get ex They're set by boat. Okay, so it looks like we're talking to these. We need to talk to these guys, huh? They have a boat, right? Or maybe I just need to go back to, um, what's his face? Uh, Log and Lun. What? There's no more. You ate all. No, you ate all, baby. There's no more. No more. I'm telling you, there's no more, baby. Okay, you wanna look? Because every time you look, there's nothing. What? What do you want? What? There's nothing. I told you. Huh? What are you looking for? I don't know. I'm done. Yeah, Daddy told you that. Go. Go. Go play. Uh, she's always looking for candy, guys. Always. Alright, so... I think I just need to head back to London Log. Open that chest already. It's like it's a ring wall. Not even sure what I'm exactly I'm supposed to do right now. What is that building to the or that location to the southeast there? Well, I don't put that in your mouth. That doggy's been eating that. That's nasty. That's doggy toy. Oh. He's not dead. He took three hits, surprisingly. And I got three piece from him. What the hell is that? Was that a boss? I think that was a boss, a mini boss, as uh, Chrono has been mentioning to me. I can't even enter that city yet. No, that wasn't a boss. I got three items from one. One monster, man. That's, um... I don't know if that's just lucky or if that's just incredibly easy. And they're giving me a quite a bit of money too, like 2,500 potch. It's quite a bit. Wow. 
Why are you like always so needy, girl? You're always so needy when you're down here with me. I don't know what to tell you, girl. Counter orb, medicine, not enough importance. Uh, where's the bridge or the boat? Seriously, you want me to pat your butt? Yeah. Girl, you just demand too much attention. Silence. I'm really glad to see all the status ailment though, man. Because the really the first the first and the second one was really lacking that. Welcome, welcome. Okay. Maybe we need to go talk to, um, what's her face? Pick it up, go pick it up! Pick it up! You need to pick it up, baby. No, you got one of two tear on your lip. wreck, wasn't it? It'll take a long time to sort out that mess, but you got more pressing business. Watch your back and your side too while you're at it. Where my husband and daughter have any help? If they cause you any trouble, just let me know. There are always more barfish to clean. Okay, so these two were of no use or help. Maybe we just need to go back to London, London uh, log. Okay, so we need a boat, right? Hey, Prince, want to use my ship to get somewhere again? Yes, to so get prison. P prison? What's a rural guy like you want to go to a prison for? Wait a sec, don't tell me. I got a friend on the inside, I wanna bust him out, right? More or less, yes. <laughs> Prince, I didn't take you for one of those to be associate to be associating with thugs and low lives. Excited? Prince, you're one lucky fella. You come to the right man. Come on, hop aboard. Alright, so it looks like we were supposed to go to uh London Log. London Lug. Lun, we're shoving off. Put some extra oomph into it. What's gotten into you, Pop? How come you're excited all of you are excited all of a sudden? Right, you girl. I'm excited you should be excited too, you know? Now get a move on. What's he all excited for? What? So whiny during this time, girl. What? There's nothing up there. You just watched it. What? You wanna look again? Every single time. What? 
What? There is none. I told you. See. No, no, no. All done. Yeah. Yeah, all done. Like Daddy told you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Kiss. Kiss. It's a kiss, Daddy. Kiss. Kiss. Thank you. I love you. Go. Go get the day. Go get the day. You want to show Daddy? You can show Daddy. Ah, uh, look. Looky there. A gate present straight ahead. What are we gonna do, Pop? We can't get any closer. They'll see us and throw us right in Slammer. We're gonna rout! Calm down, calm down. Don't get your face all scratched up for nothing. We're just checking out for you now. And I already got a plan for sneaking in. We'll have to take the long way around, though. What do you mean, the long way around? Are they both gonna join my party now? That'd be interesting to see. Alright, so we made it in. Alright, we're here. The basket mine. Tons of... Tons of water used, used to be mined here. But it's all run out now. Better been about 10 years now. And so, why did we come here? Yeah, Pops, we better not be resting here. That's way too creepy. Bet it's all crawling with ghosts. Relax, relax. It ain't haunted. In fact, the deepest part of the mine leads somewhere real good. You just gotta have some faith in your old fearless pop. Uh, Prince, do you really think this is safe? Are they both actually in my party? All right, sweet, sweet. So we have both Lund and Log in our, par our party. I have nothing but fucking... My god, that's kind of annoying. I have nothing but um, medium range. stats attack plus five is that even like significant damage like look at that that's it's it doesn't seem like that's gonna be anything significant like with that formation Chrono keeps talking about like these formations let's go ahead and do a cross Put uh, Leon in the front row. Let's check the equipment as well. Okay. 
Okay, that's good. All right. Got dogs here. Treasure chest. Resurrection PC. Is that a turtle orb? Is that resurrection piece? Oh yeah, resurrection piece. Blocks negative status effect. Not bad. Hey, no trespassing you here! We hate humans, not scram. This is the no human zone. Can't you stupid humans tell when you're not wanted? This is no human zone. Mind shot. Okay, so it looks like our only choice is just to go right into the mine shaft. Where's Nana? Nana. 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 Alright, so we're in a mine shaft with uh Wolf Linen Log. That's a new character, Purple Creeper. Causes poisoning. Wow, he uses an anchor. That's a really interesting choice of weapon. Pierce. So log should be leveling up like crazy here. Oh, nope, he only got two levels. So much for crazy. Nothing here. These guys were actually kind of kicking my ass right there. Oh, well, yesterday. Now that's a lot of level. I don't get it. Sometimes I get good level, sometimes I don't. that minecart but let's let's go this way first I feel like that way is probably the correct way to head and this is the side this is the way that we need to track uh, backtrack through for like a tress or some sort still find that anchor as a very interesting weapon Level 18 already nice. From level 5 to 18 in like two battles or three battles. Okay, so this is the dead end, anyways. Cart one over here to the left. I got nothing but medium range characters now. It's kind of annoying. I do kind of like how in this game there's like more than freaking three rolls. You can uh, put your characters in. Or, I mean, it looks like there's just three rolls that you can put your characters in. But each formation kind of varies. Martial Arts Garb. Yeah. 
Leon is going to die. I need to heal. Uh, let's not. Let's try not to use magic. Because magic is a little bit um important. Man, Log already has like way more HP than Leon. Maybe it's maybe it's better if I put him in the front row. Do that because he has way more HP, like 50 HP more than freaking what Leon has. He took a lot of damage already, though. Sounds set for. It's almost like a secret. But no, it's not. It's a really possible to reach a gate prison from here. Well, we'll find out, Leon. We'll find out. Either we'll find out together or we'll die trying. here first. Maybe we should head back to the right. Maybe. Yeah, a good thing we went back. Cause I was like, that's forking way too much and it's a pretty long path. It's probably the right way. We're gonna pass the party of treasure. Piece. That's the second tier uh, Earth Runes. I wonder if they have like third tiers in this game. That'd be awesome. I feel like they should have added that. Be nice to see something like that, you know? Alright, let's go down first. These paths are working quite a bit now. What room does he have? There's a water room as well. Let's use that to heal yourself. She has a co-op attack with uh, her dad as well. Oh my god, he didn't get the healing. <laughs> he fucking died. That kind of sucks. Two had like a party inventory too. Okay, I think I'm heading the right way here. Let's let's head back because I'm pretty sure we're missing treasure chest. Man, how is that not dead? Seriously, I actually fucking survived. They can't defeat me.
Oh, wait, that's the path back. What am I doing? I don't want to go back. Sneak attack. Nice. Uh, Alright, he's missing because he's in our front row. We did. Oh no! I thought that was the chest for a second. Uh, damn it! I, I guess we wasted time coming back. I mean, I guess that's just EXP in a way. Hey, what's up, Official McDowell? Welcome to the stream, man. I love the name too, man. <laughs> How are you doing tonight, sir? Poor gal. Man. Why? Can't carry any more items. Either this card or swaps them again. Ah, uh, fuck. Thanks, I'm doing fine. How about you? I'm not bad, man. Really enjoying this game. So it's, uh... This game has been giving me a lot of enjoy enjoyment. I didn't think any of the, um... I think, I mean, to be honest, after playing 1 and 2, not too long ago, I think I kind of want to, like, actually play the rest of the Suikoden series. Tecreases, Tactics, 1 and 2. Rose Bruce gives me 5. Um... I really hate this item system though, it's kind of fucking annoying. <laughs> if I- so I can equip it- so basically just holding it, it'll, this sure is a masterpiece. Have you played uh, Sukunum 5 before? I've, have, I've had a few people who like stop by my stream and they've never played Sukunum 5 before either. So it's kind of interesting seeing like uh, people who has played and people who haven't played. This game. Can I toss it away? A couple of times. Wow. Okay. That's that's quite of um quite crazy considering the game. The average game time for this was 80 hours. <laughs> that's quite a bit of hours, man. <laughs> Dwarf camp. Why? <laughs> the graphic like just turned to dark cloud. <laughs> like it's just the graphics just like completely changed to like dark cloud graphics. Okay. Huh? People live down here? They all kids. Nah, wait. Looks like there's something else. What are they? <laughs> Humans ain't the only ones living in Felena, you know. These here are cave dwarves. Strange bunch they are. They're hobbies digging holes. Facts, it's about all they do. They're kind of on the stubborn side, but they're real nice fellas, eh, hey, dwarves? I'd hang out with them, with them over nobles any, any day. <laughs> hmm, let me see. My friend ought to be around here somewhere. Man, all of them look the same from here. Let me get a bit closer. <laughs> kind of racist there, but yeah, they all look the same. I mean, they do kind of all look the same. You can get all kind of, kinds of different places through these tunnels. Well, except for the ones here, we hit water. 
You can't get get through uh through those at all. Okay, so I I really didn't expect the town here. That's that's kind of weird because we were we were supposed to be going into a freaking prison, and we ended up at a town. Okay, it's a good time to be selling shit right now. So, so official McDonald, which which streak it in was your favorite then? I'm kind of curious. I've had people tell me, um, I've had people tell me that five is their favorite, two is their favorite, mainly, mainly two. I'm kind of curious just to see what yours is. Secret of One was the first game as four as a four year old, and since then the series has been my favorite. Wow, you played an RPG as a four year old, dude. That is impressive, and you actually remember it too. That is even more impressive. <laughs> I'm gonna sell some counter orbs. I have one too many. I'm gonna keep the power orb. Sell one more of the counter orb. Fire ceiling piece? What is fire ceiling? I've never heard Sunbeam, that's a new one too. Magic Absorb, that's a new one. Let's sell the Pot of Failure. Secret of One is my favorite due to nostalgia reasons. Okay, nice. Yeah, I played I played Secret in One when I was like 10 year old. And I recently only played Secret in Two. That was a uh, that was a pretty amazing game. Like I, I only played it, I streamed it actually like um, in, I think it was in February or January, one or the other. And that was amazing, super amazing experience. And then, to be honest, because two was so great, I wanted to play another Suka then. And then uh, we had another viewer named Chrono seventy five. He ended up talking me to uh, streaming this game. I actually bought a PS2, bought the game, <laughs> just so I could play it, man. <laughs> so this is actually being streamed, or being captured from my PS2 right now. Okay, sugar is a little expensive, when I can see. I'm <sighs> okay, this is pretty cheap for gold and silver, isn't it? I think this is rather cheap. Um, because I remember it being like fifty-seven thousand in some places. So let's buy, let's buy this gold and silver. Because I think I could probably make like seven to like ten k profit off that. I don't know how much iron is. Um, I think this iron might be a little bit pricey. I'm not positive. <laughs> armor. You know, we haven't actually, I actually haven't bought any armors at all this game. And I can't equip any of these because these are all heavy armor. Dude, this is like so much freaking money, dude. Like, I had like 80,000 a while ago, and this is just like nothing at this point. I guess that's not common, but I'm ahead of in development since birth, or whatever that you say. That sounds good. Nothing wrong with that, man. But that's, that's still impressive that you were able to play this game at, uh, as a four-year-old. Did you actually beat the game as a four-year-old? <laughs> I spent like $700 on physical copies myself. Mommy won't let me dig any tunnels yet. Not till I can grow up here. I'm not even playing my physical copy because I was like, dude, I don't want to risk the chance of like it breaking. So I actually modded my PS2 so I can play this game without risk of damaging that disc. It's just too rare at this point. And the worst part is that 
the the worst part is that they don't have the game on um on PlayStation Network or there's no reprint of this game at all whatsoever, you know? Huh? Is someone calling me? Huh. Now I'm losing my hearing. Just what I need. So, what can I do for you? What? You want me to forge you a weapon? Well, I'd love to, being a blacksmith and all. But in order to forge a great weapon, I'm gonna need a better hammer. Don't get me wrong, human. My skills aren't the problem, but a guy can only go so far with skills alone, you see? I love to forge you, okay, so I can't. Freaking PAL versions are is, is so expensive. I don't doubt it, man. I still want to buy a copy of Sukunin 2, though, man. That was a great game. Love to buy one. Um, do I have enough to assemble anything? No, nope, doesn't look like it. Let's equip, uh... It seems like I can never equip more than just like one rune. Look at that, see? I only have like one slot I can equip these on. Is it ever gonna let me equip two runes? When do we start? Do when do we start streaming? We started like at uh, ten, I think. So an hour ago. Um. Yeah, 54 minutes. So you, I mean, it took me a while to figure out that I needed to go talk to London Log first. So Chrono, you didn't miss much, man. And we got another uh, speaking of fanatic here, man. No, oh, so you guys know each other already. Damn. <laughs> Small world, I guess. Being that it's in a speaking world. Yeah, Chrono here has been uh, savagely helping me throughout my stream. <laughs> McDowell. Skull cap. Hmm, interesting item. An empty box lying around is just gonna get you in the way, of course. Carry out, Erd. Guess we met a uh, Minjolfs, huh? He's he, is that another streamer? I'm assuming. Have you have you been? Was it there? One of the many places. More likely Zeros. And I seen I saw Zero is streaming Octopath Traveler now. He's a uh, speed running at right now. I have been to that stream before. Now to see two people that know each other in my stream, man. That's that's awesome. We don't get many humans around here, and we lucky that way. Hey, thanks for the follow, uh, Official McDowell. I appreciate that, man. Leave. Do I want to leave? No, let's not leave yet. Appreciate that. I always, have, always appreciate the support. I still think I'm gonna be playing three and four too, man. After starting playing five, dude, I, I feel like I just have a circulating, uh, circulating fe uh, fever. Damn you, Chrono. He has got off with Octopath so far. I do need to finish Octopath too, man. I just modded my SNES so I'll pump for Final Fantasy VI Chrono Trigger and other gems. Final Fantasy VI is my favorite, uh, favorite Final Fantasy. I still need to play that on stream too. I haven't played it in a while. I actually just did Chrono Trigger. I actually bought the uh, Steam version for that. Oh, cool. My father named me after uh, after Loke from Final Fantasy VI. You know, I was actually about to name my son Loke, too. Uh, Locke, actually. It's actually pronounced Locke. I keep... I, keep, I don't know why... It's, it's old habit from when I was used to play it when I first played the game. I call him Loke. But it's actually just Locke. Man, that's, I was about to. 
But my, so I gave my wife like three names. I, I think I gave him, uh, I gave him Zidane, Sora, Ramza, and actually I gave him Locke too. So it was actually four names. Hey, but she chose Sora. <laughs> oh, hey, there he is, Gunny. Not Gunny. My name is Gunde. <laughs> it ain't changed a bit, have you? Who are you? All these humans. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I'll introduce you, Gunny. Wait till you hear this. This here is Prince Feodor, and that there is Leon, a Queen's Knight. I'm actually not quite a Queen's Knight just yet. Le and there is my lovely daughter, Lun. Sora is actually the name. That's not Zora. Sora. Like, uh, Sora from, um, Kingdom Hearts. That's really cool. At least it's game, uh, at least game related. <laughs> uh, nice to meet you, Mr. Dwarf. You're lying. Huh? Who's lying? You're not friends with the prince. But, but... And your daughter wouldn't be as cute as this. What? Hey, what are you trying to do? Embarrass me? Oh, actually, I kind of like Lun. Lun is actually kind of, um... She has quite the attitude. <laughs> what? You want a piece of me, Mr. Dorm? Put up your dukes! On a second dot, this is definitely your daughter. What? What in the hell? That's supposed to me. Well, that means this is the real prince. Yeah, yeah. Kingdom Hearts. Isn't it spelled Zora? No, it's Sora. Z yeah, Zora is Zona. <laughs> yeah, Zora is the is the um the Naga from Zola. <laughs> yeah, sword basically means sky in Japanese. Never played Kingdom Hearts. It has a, it has a pretty good storyline. It's really convoluted too. But the thing is, you really need to play all of them to kind of get it too. That's which, which kind of sucks. Yeah, and we got special mission for the prince, Gunny. We're gonna. We're doing a gate prison. It ain't gonna turn that down, right? I'm in. Uh, wait. Hey, where are you guys off to? What do you think? A gate prison, of course. With that little thing? The two of us used to be in business, all so running fugitives, you know? You two are fugitive runners? Yep. We help each other get away that old, a bunch of money to your old nasty loan sharks. And when we wasn't doing that, we were helping gladiators escape. Business was booming, I tell ya. Never told me about this before. And once, we almost helped a prisoner get out of a gate prison. You did? Yep, we dug a secret tunnel there. And that tunnel should be right up ahead. Are you serious, Pop? Of course I'm serious. Follow me on, Gunny, and you're gonna see for yourself. Ah, oh, jeez. Do I have to... Gun join the party. Gunde. I think it's pronounced Gunde, isn't it? Or is it just Gund? I love how Gunde wears what looks like a handless walk as a hat. Yeah, that's... <laughs> that's intriguing. I actually really liked the uh, Log's weapon. I didn't expect an anchor, man. I was like, well, really? That's the first? I've never seen any character actually in an RPG that uses a freaking anchor. Where does this lead to? Oh, it actually leads you outside. Fuck yeah, we finally have a short range. <laughs> oh my god. Oh shit. I 
I really hate this game's menu though, man, I'll tell you that. I personally love how the prince is still in his toes, Nova hate. <laughs> Darn, dude. A seven hour runs at second and two hour YouTube. That's someone who loves the game. Somebody just did it on a YouTube stream? I should probably actually give somebody a second fish when just over. Where are we here? I want to do some exploration here. Can I even go down? The music isn't bad, that bad. The one day that may save you stupidly using the mix ever you get in the game. Oh, it's from your YouTube. Oh, <laughs> I forgot I had it up there. Yeah, I, I mean the game wasn't running seven hours, but I think I think the game took me like thirty hours total. That was the first blind playthrough. Yeah, I gotta upload some of my other videos up there. I haven't been doing that lately. Alright, so it looks like our only other choice is just to actually go to the gate prison. Just stay away from Noah's Pornhub. Dude, if I had a Pornhub shit, I wouldn't be streaming, man. I wouldn't be streaming video games, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Gotta make our portals, you know? <laughs> yeah, but two hour, uh, two seven hour sit downs. Yeah, the game was pretty awesome, so I didn't mind. <laughs> this game has been pretty awesome, too. I wouldn't mind doing, like, I, I can see myself doing like six to eight hour streams on this game easily. And I, I'm pretty sure eventually we'll get to that point too. I've been doing like four hour streams with this game. And this is uh, the fifth day already, I think. And so we have 13 hours already. And this is the start of the fifth stream. So we're averaging about three hours per stream. Oh, okay, so Lun actually has a harpoon. I just realized that. I mean, two and five are the best game if you're gonna break it down. When I first played the game, I basically played it straight through over three days. Damn, bro. <laughs> Stopping all this sleep and grab a bite. You know, I would do that too if I was still young and didn't have a family and a job and a life. I can't remember the last time I did that though. <laughs> like I did when I first played Sugita 1. Yeah, I think Sugita 1 still holds like a pretty uh, sweet place in my heart. Like, even though overall the story isn't um, that great, as good as like the 2 and 5, I feel like it's, um, it's still pretty up there for me. Just because it's, um, it's one of the very first Sugita games I've played. Did I come from the right side? Fuck, I don't remember. Cause I, I went up north. Did I? I went this way already, right? Didn't I? I actually fell asleep with a controller in my hand several times during that playthrough. I blame nostalgia. I mean, I blame Coro for getting me hooked into Secret and Five, man. I wasn't even gonna place the Secret and Series for a while, and he kept talking about it. I was like, fuck, I gotta try it out. More than two. Oh yeah, I did go that way. I still, I still want to try season three and four, though, man. 
Yep, same here. Two and five are better, but one is still my favorite dude in Stagia. Definitely. He just holds that sentimental value, you know? Oh no, Gunda is about to die. Gunda. Daughter sure knows how to dance. That's actually not my daughter. That's actually my niece. Well, that's uh, uh, she's here hanging out with my um, my other two daughters. <laughs> Both changed the formula though, so don't expect it to be similar to one and two. Yeah, I've, I've, yeah, you've mentioned that before. I'm, I still kind of want to just experience it just to see. How it is. And I remember you saying 3 is actually so hard to the point where like you actually die to normal monsters. <laughs> 3 and 4 is the same graphics as, uh, as 5 though, right? Okay, let's take the right path first. Yeah, three and four are both still kind of from the other, are far from the other games, but still really good. I heard four was kind of a joke. <laughs> Huge legs. Can the freaking name is that? I, I really wish they kind of came up with some better naming conventions for some of these monsters, though. But 3 and 4 were 3D, okay. I like 4 more than 3. Love the pirate and sea is mostly for the memes. Wait, which one is the pirate sea esteem? Or are they both pirate sea esteem? Do we see Tai Ho in them? <laughs> Chrono's favorite character? Pirate and Sea Theme is four. Unfortunately, not. My favorite character is hard to pick. You're right, it's Yoram, right? <laughs> that is very hard to pick, man, as a favorite character, but somehow you manage that. <laughs> Miyaki's is my favorite wife, hands down, but favorite character. Favorite character, I mean, I mean, so far my favorite waifu right now is Sayalids. I actually really like Sayalids, just because she got some boobs. I wouldn't choose you as my favorite character. <laughs> hey, Kuro, you should stop putting yourself down like that. <laughs> Drain piece, sweet, another one. Oh, Colonel, was it you who hate on Yurum during uh, Minjoff's stream? Probably was. He hated on Yurum during my stream, too, basically. And Egbert. Okay, so that huge leg was the boss. We hmm. What the fuck happened there? All right, I barely remember that string. I just recognize his name. <laughs> it's a her action. 
Eggbear is a decent character. Is he actually a playable character or is he just like an NPC character? Breath of the Ice. Her just further proves how little I remember. <laughs> My god, the encounter rate in this game just seems a little bit higher than the other ones. I sometimes I'm taking like just a few steps and I'm already like encountering shit. Eggbird is an interesting character. Eggbird is a weird character. <laughs> okay, so we got two uh, contradicting um, opinions here. I would say Urim does get the second best scene in the game. Is he actually a character that... Is he actually one of the 108 stars, Urim? It'd be kind of hard to believe that Urim would be one of the 108 stars. He could be. Interesting doesn't contradict weird. If you choose him. If you choose them. It's just kind of like, um... Spoilers. Yeah, but choose him between who? I don't I don't even know who, you know? <laughs> it must be like, um... Ridley from Sukunin 2, where you can choose to have his son or him. Or can you? I don't know, man. I might just choose Pikachu. God damn, so many forks in this goddamn mine. I don't remember to be honest. That's a lie, man. You've played this game like so many times, how can you not remember? You said you've played it multiple times. <laughs> you can be two Archdash cards. <laughs> Just remember him to be really annoying. Does that mean I can recruit uh, Odefsa too? <laughs> All of a sudden, Odefsa appears in this, uh, this week then. Actually, she could technically appear, right? Because she technically would still be alive in this one, since this is eight years prior to, um, Sukuna 1. She is more entertaining than Nova. You hear that, Coraline? They like you. They say they like you. Oh? Where's Luna? Luna want to sleep with Mommy? Okay. She's rip. She would be like a ten. Luna is my daughter. Coraline was the one who was dancing. That's my niece. And then my other daughter's name is uh, my other daughter's name is uh, Madeline. Yeah, Luna is actually a game name. <laughs> yeah. Madeline was the uh, my wife who picked it. But I, I didn't mind it either because it was actually a pretty good name. Pretty much, if you ask me to name my kids, it's gonna be from a game. <laughs> Don't you love how there's like no treasure in the second half of this dungeon? Dude, there was like no treasure at all throughout this whole dungeon. What are you talking about, man? Ah, uh, come on, this is a dead end. Thought you said you dug a secret turtle pop. Uh, what are you doing banging away like that? Like I said, we almost helped the prisoner escape. But just as we were finishing the tunnel, the guy we were supposed to spring got moved somewhere else. And that was the end of our job, so we just left the tunnel like it did this. Hold on a second, Pop. That means he doesn't even know if this hole goes to a gate prison or not? Come on, Pop. He's gonna be digging forever! Don't you worry about that. Cave doors are regular. Doors regular geniuses when it comes to digging holes. And old Gunny here is the best at the old. The best. The best of the best. Trust me. Luna is a beautiful game. The first half have like three. Done. Alright, you did it, Gunny. God damn it, when am I gonna get my castle, dude? That was fast. Dude, I would not be surprised if Stormfist or this place becomes my castle. This looks like a basement. 
e vir Man, I was listening to this music and it, it almost sounds like Vincent's theme from Final Fantasy 7. It really does. It's very similar to it. It has the same vibe at the very least. You really sure this is a gay prison pop? Come on, Luna. Lun, what are you gonna be so skeptified for? Anyway, pipe down, will ya? We don't want to get caught down now that we've made it this far. Good luck. I'm heading back. What? You're leaving? I hate leaving a tunnel unfinished. Now that it's done, I'm satisfied. You got a screw loose in the head of Mr. Dorf. He wants you to come with us, can you? I can't move very fast. I just slow you down. Take care, heading back, honey. All right, ready to go, Prince. And there goes my frontliner, man. Guess, I guess Log would just have to be my frontliner again. Oh, that dungeon actually surprisingly took 30 minutes. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna meet our tactician finally, huh? This definitely looks like the prison. See, I told you. Gun is a digging genius. That's no reason for you to be getting a big head, Pop. Come on, Prince. We gotta hurry and find Lady Mercy's. Can I, like, just free all the prisoners? Who's this? Can't even talk to him. That looks like Vincent did. <laughs> With a red outfit. Log's pretty much caught up now. Go away, I'm baiting. Hey, welcome back to the stream, man. See, you got your internet problem sorted out. How are you doing today? I'm good, man. How are you doing yourself? Military uniform. Yeah, it's, I, usually that happens like in the middle of the night, for some reason. It does that every once in a while. Kind of stupid, but it does that shit. I gotta sleep, dude. It's 6.30 over here. I'll see you later. Take care. Alright, later, uh, Fisher McDowell, man. Thanks for stopping by and thanks for the follow, man. Appreciate it, dude. You have a good night. 6.30 a.m., though, man? Yeah, Comcast does that crap to me at, like, 1 in the morning all the time. Yeah, I think they're freaking just throttling you at that time or something. Probably because I use too much data. I have unlimited data with them, which costs a shit ton of money. And I, I use a shit out of that. That must have to feel your baiting. <laughs> later, guys. All right, l later, man. Lock, man. I'll remember that because that's that was that's a good name. Prince, that's the way outside. Nothing stops my baiting. <laughs> Got up. You got a fat one in every time you can, right? <laughs> Go 
card ring. This really does sound like Final Fantasy, uh, like Vincent Steam from Final Fantasy VII. <coughs> Prison guard. Imagine you're immortal in space. You jack it. Eventually, you ejaculate. That ejaculation will give you a minuscule amount of thrush. You jack it again the next day. Hell, maybe the same day. I don't judge. You gain a bit of speed, and again, and again, over aeons. You will go faster, incredibly slowly. Yes, but faster still. This is how Ion Engine works. Tiny amounts of thrust, but over a long time scale, you get serious results. Eventually, your jack will propel you to appreciate. Fraction of the speed of flight. You'll be able to propel across the cosmos at the end of end of the flight. Years long, years long stream of cosmos watch. Wow. Only you would have these uh <laughs> these kind of freaking about <laughs> these kind of phrases, man, Corona. You should write a book with all these phrases, man. If you're actually coming up with them. I haven't had a boss yet in this game. Damn it! How did intruders did get I? in here? Yikes! Look at all of them. Must protect Lady Mercedes at any cost. You got it. Huh? A copy pasta. You will not pass. Do you actually have like all those saved, dude? <laughs> this is actually boss music, right? <laughs> The fuck, dude? Really? Already? I can't revive him? Jizzle revives the person holding them. Oh, okay, that sucks. So it doesn't actually, you can't... What, is there an item for reviving them in this game? Nope, okay. I always thought it revives, it's an item for reviving, but it's just an item that automatically revives. Fire orb and shield orb, okay, nice. I need to upgrade my SP, man. <laughs> Damn you, Godwin scum! You wanna slay Lady Mercies, do you? Slay her? <laughs> I'll never let that happen to Lady! To my Lady, never! Please, just hear us out. We're not who you think we are. Yeah, and how dare you call us Godwin scum. You're lucky we're just so nice. We should pummel you just for that, you know? We just want to slay that pussy dog. <laughs> Is she actually hot or something? <laughs> Take a good look. That guy look familiar. It's the prince. His royal highness the prince? You're really afraid, Dora. Prince Felena. Prince of Helena. Yes, and we'd like, to, like Lady Mercy to become the Prince's tactician. That's why we're here. Uh, I had no idea! Oh, Your Royal Highness, we offer our deepest, most humble apologies. We sincerely didn't know it was you. Damn it, Pop. If you didn't look so shady, we could have gotten in without a fight. Wait, you're saying this here is my fault? My name's C.S. I'm a guard here at the gate. A gay prison. And this is Layla. She's a prison guard as well. Koda! Prison guards are supposed to be watching the prisoners, right? So how come you're protecting one of them? The powers that... 
that be ordered the incar incarceration of Lady Mercy's we were simply following order. Uh, from the beginning, we thought her imprisonments unjust. And after guarding her for so long, we took to chatting with her to pass the time, among other things. Now we're completely on her side. We're convinced she's just the person for Lady needs right now. My lady has done nothing wrong, yet she is in prison while the despicable Lord Gawain walks like a free man. Lord Gawain? But I thought it was Her Majesty and Queen who had Lady Mercy's in prison. That's not the whole story. In fact, Lord Gawain actually ordered the immediate execution of Lady Mercy's. It was only the mercy of Her Majesty that spared Our Lady Mercy's life. Thus, she was in prison here. That's not what we heard. And now, because Her Majesty was killed during the recent revolt, we've been terrified that Lord Gawain will use this opportunity to take Lady Mercy's life once and for all. Not as hot as a tactician in 4. Okay, so 4 has a female tactician too, nice. And that's why we mistook you for Goblin's assassins. Again, we offer our deepest, most humble apologies, your highness. I'm not yet convinced. What proof do you truly have that you're the real prince and that you didn't come here to assassinate my lady? Layla, you still don't believe them. Oh, you're too trusting, C.S. If anything happened to my lady, I would never be able to forgive myself. If that's what it's going to take, I'll give you my weapon. If any of us does anything suspicious, you have my permission to strike me down immediately. What? <laughs> you want my weapon too, Lele. No, Prince, I apologize, but this is my duty, and my duty alone. You need not do this, please! As I said, this is my duty. This woman is desperately trying to protect Lady Mercy, and I understand exactly how she feels. Are you trying to protect someone you care deeply about as well? Yes, I'm the bodyguard of His Royal Ri Highness the Prince. It's my sworn duty to protect him at any cost to myself. So, why would a bodyguard give up her weapon? That's a good point. But I have to defend the Prince's intention, not just his physical well-being. I see. She's got you dearly. Hmm. Alright. I suppose I'll trust you for now. I'll take you to my lady. Right this way then. Your Highness. Oh, well, wow there. I didn't know what was gonna happen. I can say that again. Man, oh, Man, my old heart was thumping in my throat the whole time. Okay, so we're finally meeting our tactician. Lady Mercedes, may we please come in? Enter. We've brought His Royal Highness, the Prince. Thank you, Belay. Anything for you, my lady. Uh, uh you're... Lady She's Mercedes? actually pretty hot. <laughs> that is correct. Lucretia Mercedes. Mercia. Your Royal Highness, Leon, people of Rafli, I have been waiting for you. Waiting for us? How did you know we were coming? And you're saying well, Sweden 4 is even better, I huh? I didn't really know, but I was waiting for you all the same. I am a prisoner here. However, thanks to Sears and Lelay, I have the some lay. understanding of the situation outside. That is why I thought somebody would be coming for me soon. I was not sure whether it was someone who wanted to use my expertise, or someone who wished to slay me. But now I see, the prince himself came to rescue me. I am quite honored and humbled. Just like a princess in a fairy tale. Uh, huh? I welcome you. Please, will you not sit down and make yourselves comfortable? This ain't exactly what I think of when I'm hearing the word prison. It's all posh and stuff. Yeah, it's a whole lot nicer than our ship, that's for sure. Her name is Lucretia, and it almost sounds like Vincent's name. This must not be a coincidence. 
This is apparently a room in which royalty or nobles with certain circumstances are imprisoned. I was quite pleased to see how highly they regarded me when they put me in here. You don't say! So, um, Lady Mercedes, please allow me to explain the per I accept. Huh? You'd like to invite me to be his mag his highness tactician, correct? I gladly accept. Really? Just like that? One thing, though. Are you sure you want me? After all, I'm the one who advised her majesty to bear the sun room. It was you? <clears throat> During the Lord Lake Uprising, Lord Godwin planned to take advantage of the confusion and steal the sun room. I exposed the scheme to Her Majesty and told her that the only way to protect the room was to bury herself. I never knew about that. I'm sure that whenever Lady Siley speaks of me, she acts a bit strangely, does she not? That's quite understandable because it was my fault that Her Majesty's mind was slowly, was slowly taken over by the room. My lady, you need not apologize for your actions. If you didn't get the advice you did, Lord Godwin would have gained control of this country two years ago. That is true. Nevertheless, as you can imagine, that has little to do with the feelings of the Queen's sisters. I see. And there is another problem, Your Highness. You see, back then, I was actually Lord Godwin's tactician. I wasn't supposed to do anything that would conflict with his personal interests. In spite of that, I gave prior to my own judgment over my duty as a tactician. Thus, I betrayed Lord Godwin. And the price for that was my imprisonment here. Do you understand, Your Highness? I made that decision quite easily, you see, despite knowing the consequences. If I think you are doing something wrong, Your Highness, I will betray you too. So with the understood that you still want me to be your tactician. <laughs> so I don't think, can you actually, re I'm, I'm pretty sure you can't refuse, right? By the way, the tactician in 4 is ugly as shit. Any ugly in the name would be Nova. <laughs> yes, please. And I would join you, Your Highness. From this day forward, I am no longer a noble. I am a tactician server under His Royal Highness. Call me Lucretia. My lady. I mean, Lucretia, I... Lele. CS. Would you too like to come along as well? Do we have permission, Your Highness? It's alright with you, is it not, Your Highness? Your Highness, I am honored and humbled that you will have us. Indeed, as I swore an absolute devotion to my lady, I now swear the same devotion to you, Your Highness. You have befriended, okay! Our second care, our recruit, our third recruit, and our fourth recruit. Sweet! Your Highness Lucretia, you must continue to take great heed throughout the prison. We can count on but a handful of guards as my lady's allies. The others have great hostility towards her. I can't bear to think what they'd do if they got their hands on my lady. Indeed, I'm trying to break out of the prison after all. I'm sure they won't let me simply waltz out of here. Ah, oh, damn. And here I'm going to think I was going to be a whole heck of a lot easier. Huh. Anybody gets in our way, we'll just send them packing. We knew this was going to be a fight, right, Prince? Oh, sweet. So she's Let's try accuracy of technique.
Alright, that's good enough. Let's get going. Still pretty weak. We did it. Why are they so weak? A pretty decent level. <clears throat> Unupgraded weapons. This is all I can think of. Ah, it's been two years since I breathed the air outside the slammer. Marvelous, isn't it? So refreshing. The air outside the slammer. Where the hell did that come from? Yes, what can I say? Marvelous air is marvelous air. That wasn't what I was talking about. Your Highness, right this way, please. Prince, we better hurry. If my intuition is correct, Rafi, it may well be in, may well be in danger right about now. Huh? In danger? In danger? How? You will see soon enough. Come, let's let us make haste. They lack gear and upgraded weapon. I kind of figured they just lacked the gear too. What's going on? What happened? Intruders! The intruders inside! What? No way! How could they have gotten in? I don't know! This is an emergency, so we have to move the prisoners by ship. Don't worry, we'll take care of everything. You two look for the intruders. Alright, got it! Oh, what well, do you know? How easy was that? Hmm. As a fellow guard, I must say that I'm deeply embarrassed. Never mind that. Come on, we've got to hurry. We've got to go see if Raffi is really in trouble. Huh? What the hell are those things? That's... General Barum's Luger's fleet. I assume they're headed for Rat Fleet. Hold up. You say we're dealing with a fleet? All them things are warships, and they're headed right at Rat Fleet? You've gotta be kidding. If they attack Rat Fleet, it's gonna be a smoldering pile of driftwood in no time. Well, I wouldn't be too sure about that. Are you saying we can't. we can beat them? We get blown away by one warship, let alone that many. Oh my, please calm down. Didn't you just ask me to come along for something for just exactly this type of situation? Corey, go find a controller for Uncle. And your Uncle will turn something you like. I guess we did. Well, they don't look like they're about to attack us just yet. Prince, let's hurry to Red Fleet. you find it, Corlin? No. Baby shark do 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 something they like. Uh, this one is more into the toddler stuff now, or more like the yeah toddler stuff. Stop! Stop right there! What the hell are you guys doing here? What the hell do you guys do? What the hell are you guys doing here? Yeah, don't go blocking away your damn bullies. Logging Lun? What are you guys doing on that boat? We thought you were Godwin's men. Man, it's a real long story. The princess of us went and got us a real important tactician. There ain't nothing better. A tactician? Wow, just what we need right now. Godwin's fleet has gone and picked up a fight with us. Everybody's running around like crazy here. I'd like to know the situation in every detail. 
Prince, let's go see Amaraja, shall we? Akura, <laughs> you like dancing so much. Okay. I feel like Raffley is going to be our base. Your Highness? Hey, where have you been? Lucretia? Did you say Lucretia? Lady Silence, I'm a Raja. It's been a long time. Ah, and that man must be Death Blow George, and the lady must be Log's wife, Kassara, correct? How do y'all do? My name is Lucretia Mercedes. I've just become His Royal Highness's personal tactician. I'm looking forward to working with all of you. How do you do? Never in a million years did I. Uh, what do you know? <laughs> I've been looking into busting out Lady Mercy's myself, but I kept running to dead ends. And here you come casually strolling in with her like it's no big deal. <laughs> this isn't the time to be joking. Raffley is in a castle, so that'd be fine. <laughs> I mean, the only reason I think so is because the this giant boat here has a uh, it has a freaking uh, bath, right? I mean, if if you think about it, none of the other cast or none of the other um, towns ever has baths. So what's the situation? Oh yes, that's right. General Bottom Luger's fleet delivered an ultimatum. They order us to surrender our autonomy and swear allegiance to the future queen, Princess Limslayer. If we don't, they'll subjugate us by force. When I heard that, I rushed over here. It's one thing to go after us, but to go after Ratfleet as well? You're either with them, or you're against them. It's that simple. They hate us, of course, but they hate self-governing regions like Ratfleet almost much. And they're doing all this just in the name of poor Princess Limslayer. How dare they? So, what do you plan to do, Amro? <sighs> I used to head up that fleet, you know. And Bar Baram was my most trusted assistant. I trusted him with my life. In fact, I know better than anybody just how formidable he can be. It would be crazy for us to try and take on Godwin Navy head on, especially with Braham at the helm. But I'm not quite—I'm not a quitter. And there's a, but and there's not a quitter here in Raffley. But I don't know what to do. It's simple. All you have to do is drive them away, Admiral. All you have to do is... You make it sound so simple. Well then. This must mean you have a plan, eh, Lucretia? Yes, that's right. But you're... But your highness is tech... You're his highness tactician, aren't you? Yes, good point. Prince, what would you like to do? Would you aid Ratfleet? <coughs> Of course! And they just leave the party just like that, huh? Your Highness! Are you sure, Your Highness? We refuse your request, remember? Thank you, Your Highness. I can't begin to express Raffley's gratitude. Alright, let's get started then. I want you to close all the sluice. Sluice gates upriver from here. Can you do that for me? Huh? Well, I think if we ask Luce Arena, she'd do it for us. Aha! <laughs> now I'm starting to get the picture. Oh, I forgot all about that too. You're incredible. Always thinking three steps ahead of everyone else. And you've always been like this. 
Oh, you need not praise me so. I just have a good memory, that's all. So basically, we're gonna flood them away. Here's Serena. Okay, we're in a war battle already, nice. And if you give me a chest. Of course you remember they turn you down, that's why we don't feel so bad and comply this time. General, there's been an answer from Rafferty. They have an aud audacity to refuse our request. Just as I expected. I didn't think Admiral Roger would go for it. In that case, is that time, sir? We have no choice. Are you sure, sir? Many of our senior members used to serve under Admiral Raja. You don't have to tell me. I myself am one of those members. The Lord Godwin is right. If Elena is to ascend to its greatest potential, it must be truly united. We can't have regions that move around as they please, writing their own laws. We must have cultural homogeny. If Admiral Raja can't see that, I will have to defeat her in battle, even if I am seen as a traitor. Oh boy. This is like fighting my own children. Admiral. Going against my most trusted student. This has to be fate. People of Rafflet, I want you all to understand the gravity of this battle. Rafflet's very ex existence is on the line. I want to give this fight everything you I want you to give this fight everything you got. And don't forget about us! The Prince wants to save Rafflet, and we're gonna do everything we can to make that wish come true. We really appreciate you coming to support us, Lord Wild. But please don't let your feet get out in front. That would be dangerous. Dangerous? General! The river's water level is going down! Did they close the sluice gates? Oh, the fate of the river is deep. A, de a desperation move like that won't get them anywhere. Don't worry about it. All battles should continue to advance! Here they come! Here they come! Here they come! Here they come! It's all going to court the plan. Draw them to you, but don't let them get too close. <coughs> half. I should half or neutralize all. Very door and back. Ship. Destroyed. Get the details. Alright. Our second war battle in this game. Interesting. See how this go. Your Highness, may I have a word? This is your first time in a naval battle, right? Ships can be divided into three types, each with own strengths and weaknesses. Combat should overpower rams, which in terms overpower archer ship, which in turns overpower combat. Try to kill the ships under the Luger. Yeah, because you just you just need to have the the Luger fleet, right? So it's probably easier to actually kill the, the minions over the over the boss. So it's combat over rams, ram over archers, archer over combat. Okay. Keep these relationships in mind. You'd be at the greatest disadvantage if you don't plan attacks accordingly. And there are more ships in addition to the three basic types, but you can figure those ones out on your own. Your leadership will determine the fate of Rafi, so I don't want to see you give it all. You give it all you got. Alright. Dude, this is actually really cool. You, you are right, man. This this uh this strategy battle is pretty This strategy is uh this real time strategy shit is actually pretty cool. Ugh What's the matter, Battleship One? Please report your status immediately. Seem to have hit something, sir. What? But how? There shouldn't be any shallows around here. What's going on? The riverbed in that area is covered in wreckage. Huge pieces of wreckage from the Dan Lord Barrows tried to build. After Lord Lake destroyed the dam, we tried to clear the wreckage away. But there wasn't much we could do about the debris left on the river floor. It's not a problem for us, but warships like Lugers will run. A ground on the debris before they know what hit them. 
That us a three of fire stranded as well, sir. They can't move. Damn it. How come the enemy isn't having the same problem? Because they know these Rafflet people. They're the ones with the river. Wowzers, half of them fell for it already. What a kick in the pants for it. My lady, shall we take advantage of this opportunity and wipe them out? We need not, we need, uh, we need not do that. Right, Admiral? Right, as long as we dry them out. That's good enough for me. It has to do with getting items. Items? We don't want them to take take lives on, unless it's absolutely necessary. Don't bother with the ships that have that have run aground. Just target the ones that can still move. And we'll help too! Which one is still moving? So this one is stuck, that one's stuck. Just these three, huh? Archer. So two Archer and one Calm. Calm was weak to uh, Archer. And Ram is strong against. Show them what the Rat Fleet men can do. Do it. Actually, avoid his impossible. Get them. Shoot! Shoot! Can characters die in uh, strat strategic battles? Also, you use some special by pressing either square or circle over the unit with a special ability. I think they can die. I've never seen it though. Never fear, man. We're gonna charge right through these guys. <laughs> We're done for. All mobile ships, pick up the survivors. We're pulling out. Really? Log has barrage along for long range attack. Well, no flowing pieces for us. That sucks. Oh well. That sucks. I mean, he kind of came at us though. Like, it's not like I could just technically avoid him. Your Highness Lucretia. We are forever indebted to you. You've saved Rafferty as we know it. On behalf of all of us, I thank you. It was all Lucretia. But you were the one who decided to save Rafferty, Your Highness. I simply advised you. And now it's our time to help you. What do you mean? Did Lund tell you? Rafferty women always repay their debts twice over. She wasn't kidding, you know. Prince Feodor, from now on, Rafli is your steadfast ally. We will see this battle throughout through to the end. Wow, Prince. Frederaja. Frederick Sara. 
What about London Log? So it looks like you're heading back to Rainwall. I'm sorry, but I have to stay here. I'll have Kassara go with you in my place, though, as a proud representative of Rathfleet. Yes, Admiral. So it looks like I'll be accompanying you from here on, Your Highness. Man, I got a big party now. Do I actually have six members for once? I didn't log already joined, I believe. And it never said it befriended them, though. If you kill a small archer ship, it gives you a float piece. I think the other ship gives you a piece of new equipment. And that kind of sucks, but oh well. Well, the thing is, they never give you any save points either. It's just like, okay, here, go here, go there. It would have been nice, because I would have loved to replay that. Actually, it did give me a save point right here. I'm just an idiot. What am I talking about? All right, let's 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 save. <laughs> That's all right, though. Give me one second. Let me see if I can find a controller for the kids. If I thought I'd, did I take it? Alright, I'm back. Alright, sorry about that. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, so we have to head back to Ringwall. Let's take a look at our items. Not enough pieces for anything. Right though. Did I have an item to identify? Yeah, I did. Let's take a look at my party. I am um, gonna pick fast party now. I still don't have a castle yet. Fifty-seven thousand here, so I can make seven k profit. Let's do it. I have one hundred thirty thousand right now. Nice.
So, it looks like Baram, Baram has failed us. We're lucky that casualties were as low as they were. That even was stronger than anticipated. Much stronger. So, Father, what do you think about Lucretia and Mercy siding with them? Good riddance. A great leader should be surrounded by loyal men, not backstabbers like her. She looks like she wouldn't harm a fly, but that woman eats people alive, both her enemies and her friends. Do you really think a fool like Barrows and a brat like the prince will be able to control her? No, nobody can. So you want to sit back and enjoy the show then, Father? Lord Godwin! General Dilbert Novum has arrived! Alright, on time. Thanks for coming. I presume you've heard about Brahim. Baram. Yes, my lord. He still has much respect for Admiral Raja. This was surely no ordinary battle for him. No, General Ruger isn't so weak as to let personal feelings interfere with his duty to his country. As his comrade, General Novum, you should know that. The Prince and Lady Mercedes were on the rafting side. That was General Ruger's downfall. Interesting theory. Lord Novum, I mean, Dilber. The Prince and his rebel forces have infested Rainwall. I'd like for you to put them down, once and for all. Humph, <laughs> I thought you'd never ask, my lord. I'll crush anyone who dares defy you, comrade or noble, it makes no difference, they all bleed the same. That they do. And if we need blood spill, who better to wield the sword than my greatest general? I await news of your victory. I will not fail you, my lord. Ah, oh, we're back in rain. Rainfall already. Why is this spec out rainfall? There's not a single speck of rain. Rain wall, you was it rained? Yeah, you're right, it is rain wall. I keep thinking it's rainfall for some reason. <laughs> oh, your royal highness, I offer you the heartiest congratulations on your ever so magnificent victory. Indeed, news of your highness' incredible exploits has already spread throughout the whole of Rainwall. You recruited Lady Mercedes as your tactician, drove off General Luger, and even secured Rafflet as an ally. What would no one do without my constant belittle remarks? Play the game like a normal person, that's what. <laughs> All of that in one fell sword, my mind. Marvelous work. Absolutely marvelous. Oh, I'm so very, very proud indeed. And what exactly do you have to be proud of? Ah, Lord Barrows, how do you do? I'm sorry for Rafflet, you're proud new ally. I'm here on Raja's behalf. It's a pleasure to meet you, Lord Barrows. Oh, and such a lovely representative Raja has chosen. My, my, the pleasure is all mine. I definitely assure you. So, Rafli defeated the General Luger, did they? With such power on my side, I feel very, very secure indeed. Oh, but it wasn't Rafli alone. We couldn't have done it without you, the help of Prince, of the Prince and Lucretia. It's nice to see you again, Lord Barrows. Oh, well, well, if it isn't the lovely Lady Mercedes. My, your beauty has not faded in the least. Oh, your incarceration caused me many, many sleepless nights, my lady. But it appears you've, you're none the worse for, for wear. Thank you very much, Lord Barrows. Lord Barrows, we all may be from the most diverse of background, but we all have been brought together by one man. That man is the prince. I propose we all put our interests aside and work to selflessly support his cause. Oh, of course. Of course! Indeed, you know that my loyalties have always been with his royal highness the prince, yes? I always have and always will. Serve humbly with selfless devotion. <laughs> well, room shall be prepared for all of you in just a moment. 
and tell them, my valiant hero. Relax, relax. Oh, oh. Oh, your highness, I'm so glad you made it back safely. Oh, please excuse me. I was so relieved. It seems I forgot myself for a moment. You did it, your highness. This is more like it. <laughs> Same line. Lucretia, she's impressive in more ways than one. You wish to change your traveling companions, do you? Oh, you got the use for old Jesus like me. Oh God, please don't tell me he is. This place is actually gonna be um, my new uh, base. This place really can't be my new base, can it? There are five option recruits available right now. Seven if you count non -star. There's actually non-star recruits too in this game. Is it more like the animals, I guess? In uh, Secret in 2? A remarkable victory, your highness. We'll have to fight just as hard in the next battle. Is this really gonna be my base, dude? I can't imagine this being a base. I want the castle, man. Selfless devotion from that old snake. Yeah, right. Oh, it pains me to see my lady have to play along with a fool like him. That's a classic strategy, though. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Right, Lucretia? Read it to what you will. But you know, there's something I've been wondering about. Leon, is the coast clear? Huh? Oh, yes, ma'am. No, I don't hear anyone. Your Highness, I would like to find out the truth behind the Lord Lake Uprising. Lord Barrows is hiding something important. I can feel it. Yeah, we've been thinking that too. We've, we've been to Lord Lake several times, and there doesn't seem any dirt on Lord uh, on Barrows there. No, the answer doesn't lie in Lord Lake alone. The riders got as far as the East Palace after all. Officially, Barrow soldiers were overwhelmed by the sheer size of the mob. But I've always wondered if that was the real story. But won't it be hard for us to snoop around? Barrows will know something is up. Not if we have the help of a professional detective. A detective, huh? Oh yeah, the two, the three detectives that I met earlier? I guess four technically? But I didn't meet the leader, yeah, Oboro. Yes, someone who can find skeletons even in the most like, tightly locked closet. His name is Oboro. Oh, boy, I know him. His office is actually shipped, so he often comes to Rafley to visit. He just finished up a case, so he should be free right now. Your Highness, shall I have my husband and, your da uh, and daughter negotiate with him? No, Oboro is more is a, is a most important potential ally. That is why I think it would be best if you, Your Highness, spent with him directly. He's usually at one port or another, so he, he might be docked here in town right now. Why don't you check, Your Highness? All right, so we're gonna get Shigari, Shigari, and Shigure, and then uh, I forgot what the other girl's name was, Lucretia. Yes, I need to know one thing. Why are you helping my nephew? Is it to make up for what you did? No. In the end, I only delayed the inevitable by two years. 
but I still think it was the right thing to do. And I became the Prince Tactician because it, too, is the right thing to do. There's nothing more to it than that. <laughs> Damn, woman. I really, really hate you. You know that, Lucretia? But I do feel a little bit better now. And my nephew needs your strength. Please help him, Lucretia. This is really good music right here, man. I will. And then it changed to fucking the barrels of steam. <laughs> God. Dude, Chrono, is this really my fucking base, dude? <laughs> it's quite depressing if this is actually my base. Prince suck up! Prince suck up! Suck up! Suck up! Prince suck up! That's what my daddy calls you. He said Lord Barrow has to do everything for you. Can I recruit her now? What? Don't waste my time with Fighter Chatter. I need to concentrate. I believe I already asked you not to disturb me. Why should I talk to you if you're not even able to listen? This is the base you get for touching yourself at night. Hey man, who doesn't touch themselves at night? <laughs> hey, there's a treasure chest here. A spirity ring. There are no recruits in Rainwall, actually. Really? Interesting. Not even the investigators? I would have thought the investigators would have been, um, recruits. Oh, Prince! Welcome! Detective! Detective Oboro! The Prince is here! Okay, okay, I'm coming. Hello, hello! Welcome to our agency. Here's my card. <laughs> Any of the faces may be recruitable eventually, but none of them are recruitable now. Okay. Fair enough. Oboro? Of the Oboro Detective Agency? Um, what's this piece of paper for? It's my business card. Haven't you ever seen one before? I invented them, you know? I think they're pretty snazzy, but they're not catching on like I expected. Oh, uh, yeah, they're snazzy. Like you say. Detective, that's enough chit chat. Time to talk business. Uh, I guess you're right. Let's find out how we can help you guys then. Right this way, please. Interesting. So you'd like us to investigate what Lord Barrows was up to at the time of the Lord Lake uprising, eh? That's not about the size of it. Yes, can you do that for us? Can we ever? We'll have barrels covered in dirt before you know it. Just like that, detective. The uprising was two years ago. Do you really think we can do it? Please, with us involved, two years is like two minutes. Besides, the prince wants us to solve a mystery. And who doesn't love a good mystery? Well, I guess you have a good... I have a point. Oh, alright, fine. Oh, about the fee, Prince. I'll talk it over with your people later. Sagiri! Shiguri! Come on, wake up! It's time for you. It's time for work. I'm a I'm awake. Ah, oh, jeez. What do you want? Man, what a pain in the... Alright, leave the rest to us. When the investigation is complete, I'll come give you a report. We should be done in no time. All right, thank you very much, Detective. Huh? What is? Hmm. Is something wrong, young lady? Uh, no, nothing's wrong at all. Sorry about that, Prince. I don't know what came over me. Well, we met with Detective Obaro. Let's go back and check in with the others. Who, uh, who do I have in my party? Let's check 
leave. Go to the end. No, no, but I'll give you advice now because it's very helpful and missable. Go to the end, okay. Oh, the guy right there. The Garwin faction must be running low on money. That's what made them angry. Enough to stage a rebellion. <laughs> what you want from me? Uh, let's wait here, Kasim. Are oh, you playing just like the pants? Whatever. Leave me alone, man. I said quit bugging me. Get out of here. <laughs> I said quit bugging me. Get out of here. <laughs> That's all I can do with him then? Let me tell you, options from here on out are very important. So don't mess up the dialogue. Leave the in. Hey Prince, stop horning on us, man. It's a pain. Shigure? You gave us this job, so quit messing with our work. What do you mean? We're investigating that drunk! Huh? Why would you need to investigate him? And his name is Norton. He was the vice captain of the Barrows Garrison during the Lord Lake Uprising. He resigned after fa uh, failing to stop the rebellion from passing through Barrows territory. That guy? He's coming up. Let's hide. Uh, alright. Like the guy right there, wearing the same exact clothes. Who was that guy who followed him? That was a lookout, man. Ugh, what a pain. We should follow him. Guess we gotta. I'll go too. What? You wanna go? We better hurry, or we may lose them. Yeah. Standing around is a pain too, but have it your way. Hey, we got them to join our party. What the hell, they're level 35 and 30? save I think I just saved but let's save again this way. Your Highness, is it true that you're going out with Serena? And that you have Lord Barrows' permission? Oh, I don't believe it. That's impossible. Let's see if I go this way. When does the main character get a rune, man? When does he get his true rune?
He doesn't get a true rune. Really? But all the, the secret of one and two, he gets a tr uh, all the main protagonists get a true rune. That sucks. What did you, what did you and the prince speak of just now? You haven't let anything slip, have you? What the hell are you talking about, man? Now I'm just some stupid kid in a little old costume. <clears throat> you truly are pathetic. <clears throat> I think you know already, but there, here's a reminder. You'll live longer if you keep your mouth shut. Hey man, get out of here. You're killing my buzz, man. Heck. You need to come back. You've been very loose lipped drunk lately. Keep it up and you it'll be the end of you. <coughs> I said get out of here, man. Heck. I'll keep an eye on you. Given your carelessness, I'm sure we'll meet again. He gets part of a true rune. And, and to be fair, two Ryu doesn't get a true rune either. He gets part of a true rune. I mean, that's, that's close enough, isn't it? Yeah. Damn. What a pain. We gotta follow the other guy now, too. That won't be necessary. Who the hell is that? Detective Obara? Ah, the Prince of Leon. You're here too, I see. Shouldn't we follow that man? Nope, that's not necessary. I have a way to find out where he's going. Let me go home and sleep then. Still in the middle of a job. Ah, yeah, that's right. What a pain. Shall we continue the investigation then? Are you going to stick around, Your Highness? I want to see how this unfolds. Why you gotta stick your nose in our business? What a pain. Well, this is the prince's job, and he's our client. If he wants to come along, he's more than welcome. Let's get going then. Dead end. Did you want something? I'm just here to meet someone. You have gone into that house? Someone wasn't watching. I was following the drunk. Squeak. Ah, welcome back. Nice work. A mouse? Squeak, squeak. You figured it out already. I'm impressive as always. Let's follow. Okay. Mouse is one of my trusted employees. One of my best assistants, really. He followed the man who was threatening Norton. What? So that man is an adventure? That's right. We've got to think over our next move carefully. Let's return to the office for a bit. Let's 
So what happens if you choose not to uh, go with these guys? Some thug, some thug into maintaining his silence, huh? And you saw the thug head into the mansion. What could it all mean? It means Nora knows about a certain skeleton in Lord Barrow's closet. Missed out some scenes. It also earns like this point with the investigators and Norton that are necessary to recruit them later. So you're saying I won't get them? Is that what you're saying? That's why they want him to shut up. And I bet the skeleton concerns a certain Lord Lake uprising. So if we can speak to Norton, this job will pretty much be over. Oh wait, wait, no, no. Okay, you missed out on scenes, basically. It's very easy. You very likely wouldn't. Okay. Yeah, like, who would have expected Norton to just randomly appear in an inn? That, that is very easily missable. Because, you know, I was just in there before and he wasn't even there. This job would be pretty much over. That's right. Your Highness, I'll ask you again. Oh, would you like to do that? This is our responsibility after all. You can leave this to us if you want, but you're still more than welcome to come along. I've come this far. I can't leave. Same here. This is so exciting. Ah, a good mystery is always addictive, isn't it? But you'll need a bit of this guise if you want to come along. Oberon and Gang can be gone later, but it'd take a, lo it'd, it'd take a lot of effort, okay? the perfect disguises. Now you don't look like the prince in a queen's knight in the, in the least. I'm still an apprentice if anyone ever ever bothered to listen. Ah, what a pain. Hey, who are these dirty brats? The prince of Leon. What? That can't be a hottie that can't be a hottie like Leon. Serious? It's true. Shigure, and you call yourself a detective. Ah, shut up. Anyway, we gotta get going. That drunk's knocking back again. Ah, is he? Let's go have a talk with him then, and solve our little mystery. Where can he be? The only place I can think of he would be is back in the end. Yep. Heck. <laughs> you. You guys again? Man. <laughs> Please, we need to talk. Heck. I don't got nothing to say to you, stupid kids. Get out of here, man! Sir, just give us a quick moment of your time. We would like to talk about Lord Lake. He hear us out. Might as well save again. Huh? In case you mess up the next part. A little bit too late. A little bit too late. Huh. Who are you? Crazy man. Who am I? Yeah, this is who I am. Him and his business card, man. You crazy man. Why you give me some stupid old piece of paper? You don't know. It's called a business card. Anyway, just have a look at it. I'll tell you who I am. Uh. 
<laughs> you say you as a detective man? Get out of here. I don't know none. Oh, but I think you do. I said, Lord Link. Lord Link. Hey, man. No so loud. Not too late. There's still more parts to this. We ain't done. Why should you care if I say Lord Link? Where one of barrels higher up to here? <laughs> How'd you? Shall we go somewhere else then? Grr. All right. We should take this conversation to my office. Welcome back, Your Highness Detective. And this must be Norton? That's right. You ain't getting anything out of me. I can't force you to talk, Norton, but I think you'd be better off if you smoke now. And if I don't, you're gonna torch me, man? Do you want me to? Um. Well, I hate to disappoint you, but we don't use those kind of techniques here. Giri, Shigure, get the boat ready for departure. Okay. What a pain. That sounds like freaking, uh, Tai Ho's bar. Oh, where are you taking me, you crazy ass detective? Your Highness, where would you like to take him? See how many tiny characters get story? These characters are relatively minor characters, but they get their own parts in the story. Even optional stars. Yeah, you're right. This is actually quite a bit of a backstory. Shall we take it up there? Ah, scene is believing, isn't it? Let's go. We're going to Lord Lake, aren't we? That dirty rat. Yeah, we are going to like. And we learn each of the personalities as well. Yeah, that's that is actually really nice. You right? You right? Wizard tree. Any ninja's fantasy. <laughs> huh? One? Can I enter Lord Lake? This is the first time you've been back since the uprising ordered. Take a look. Pretty bad, would you say? Or do you like that scorch earth looking in your towns? 
Fuck! Oh no. You can't pin this on me. It wasn't my fault. No, I think you realize all too well the seriousness of your crime. That's why you refuse to talk and attempt to drink your memories away. Am I right? What else can I do? I can't change the past. With this, it's in inhumane. Then you know what you have to do. You need to atone for your sins, or you won't be able to go on living. Atone? You really think I can? Well, that's up to the people who are suffering due to your crime. If you refuse to atone, you only add to your guilt. I... I need to think. What a pain. What I still to think about, man. You. Shigeri, that's enough for now. So if you don't talk to uh, Norton at first, I'm assuming you probably can miss Norton. Let's go back. Even though the people of Lord Lake won't be your allies, we won't side with the Godwins either. Besides, the people here don't really have energy to fight anymore. They can barely muster energy to move. That wouldn't be if any. It wouldn't be any use to you, Your Highness. Leave, I guess. Heck, you fight the mini boss. Cause I think this was the mini boss of this area. Let's see if he drops three items. Yeah, see, I fought him before though. So you can fight the mini boss multiple times. One time per visit to you. Are you sure? Because I fought him before. Per visit. So you're saying like every time if I leave the area and come back, he appears, right? That's what you're saying. Okay. That's pretty cool. I didn't know that. Wait, you dirty rats! Huh? What's going on? Barrel soldier, what are they doing here? There they are. Those are the goddamn Godwin agents. Huh? You've seen you looking around Barrel's mansion. Give up or you'll be sorry. Ah, let's come to this then. What should we do? Let's fight. You got it. Fine, fine. What a man, what a pain. It's a fight you want, eh? Don't expect any mercy from us. Fucking like suplex him. Ah, oh, but she gets stunned for that. That's 
sucks. Sylee's in her monument here. <laughs> Nothing gets past you, huh, Chrono? Ugh! Well, that's that! Let's leave the scene for now. I'm sure reinforcements are on, are on the way. Ah, oh, I was worried for a moment. Sorry. This is my fault. Don't worry about it. This is our job. We're used to it. I wonder why they attacked all of a sudden. I don't think the House of Barrows was too worried about Norton talking on his own. But when we started moving in on him, they felt threatened as well as they should have. So they decided to silence him? Yeah, that sounds about right. Your Highness, please forgive me. I will tell you everything I know about the Lord Lake Uprising. Thanks, Norton. However, I will need some time to get my head together. I'll tell you everything you need to know, though I promise. It's okay, Norton. I can understand where you're coming from. I'm just glad you decided to finally come clean. Your Highness, leave the rest to us. We'll need to hide Norton for a while to keep it safe, but don't worry. We'll pay you a visit with the truth when you need it, Your Highness. Getty left, Shigari left, Obero left, Norton left. The fuck, why am I Rafli? Yeah, why am I Rafli? Now we can go explore for our recruits. And unfortunately, I think I might have to call it a night here, though. It's 1 a.m., I have to get up at 6. It's so, like 4 hours. So, we'll, we'll be back tomorrow, though. Hopefully, I can start my stream a little bit earlier tomorrow. Oh, sucks. Because it's getting to the good parts. Recruiting. Recruiting is always fucking fun. Wait, so you can... The doctor? Can I recruit the doctor now? Your Highness the Prince, we meet again. Please join us. Your Highness, I am honored that you accept to be such an invitation. But it's very important to me that I remain neutral. Purpose to provide medical care to our armory and faction. General Lugus, please suffer severe casualty. I came as soon as possible. Rafferty's casualty were unfortunately very minimal. But. So, when the fuck does he join you then? Your Highness, I'll do anything you ask. Please let me serve you any way I can. You can sexually pleasure me. That's it. We get a like this part from him after each war battle, basically. That's that's actually quite different from like the other ones where you actually need to earn likeness points, make them like you first, which is pretty cool. That's that's all I'm making you do for now. All right, sounds good. All right, we'll continue this tomorrow. If anything, I'll wait until you pop online first, Chrono. Expect you to be there. <laughs> Alright, man. Thanks for uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. Appreciate the support, guys, as always. That stream wouldn't be as fun without you guys. But you have to ask him to join each time to get set point. Okay. Alright. Sounds good. 
All right, guys, not a good stream today. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll be back again tomorrow. I'm usually wrong. I didn't get a mobile route this time. Yeah, I'm not sure why. That's uh, <laughs> I'm not sure because that's that's usually your notifications, right? That you have to, that does that. But anyways, good night, everyone. And thanks for tuning in again.